Hey, what's going on, guys? Back again with another throwback review. This is going to be for Season 2, Episode 3, entitled Save the Last One. Alright, guys. This episode kind of starts out a little different. It kind of flash forwards to the end of the episode, which we really don't know what to make of it. And so Obviously, it'll all come full circle at the end of the episode, but it shows Shane in uh, Herschel's uh, bathroom, and he's about to take a shower. He's... He, you hear like the sound of a of, of a of an electric uh, shaver, and he's shaving his head. He's he's basically getting himself like you know, uh, like like he's going to the damn army. You know, he's getting a buzz cut. You know, he's shaving all his hair off and stuff. So we really don't know what to make of this. At, you know, at the, at the time of the episode just starting, and uh, and then we go to the opening credits, and then once after the opening credits, it shows Shane and Otis. They're all bound. You know, they're binded up in the school with all the walkers just surrounding them and they're running they get to the, the gymnasium and they're on top of the bleachers and everything and they're trying to figure out where you know a way to get out and on shane notices some uh some gla- uh some windows across the way and he, he's gonna get through them and try to get out and make a run for it and otis said he's he, he's too big to go to fit through those windows so he knows another way through the locker room so they, they 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 separate and they distract the walkers each way you know so they try to they get out and eventually, you know, they're 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 almost out, but they said they're down to like uh, Otis actually runs out of bullets, and uh, Shane has one bullet left, and they're and Shane is struggling. He when he jumped out of the window, he kind of sprained his leg a little bit, so he's kind of limping along, and, and then it looks like they're just not gonna make it. You know, they're they're out of bullets, they're 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 exhausted, and then Shane ends up, you know, they're they're going, and Shane's like, I'm sorry. And Otis is like, what? Boom. Shane, Shane shoots Otis in the leg. Basically just making a diversion so he can get out of there. And the reason we find out that Shane was shaving his head is because Otis had one of the, the bags with the supplies in it. So Shane's trying to get it off of his shoulder. And Otis is like not giving up without a fight. And he's, he grabs a chunk of Shane's hair and ends up pulling it out before the Shane can get away. And the walkers start devouring uh, Otis. But it's a big chunk of his hair is missing. So I, later on in the episode, I guess whenever he got back, he wanted to shave that just to, so nobody would ask questions, you know, you know, what had happened and everything. And also on the episode, uh, back on the highway, Daryl and Andrea kind of go out looking at nighttime to, I guess, do another sweep and see if they see any signs of uh, Sophia or anything. And while they're out there they don't really they don't really find anything but they come across some some guy that was <laughs> i guess alone and he's he's hanging from a tree he's a walker but he's hanging from a tree and all his legs are all eaten from the other walkers and everything and he left a note behind said got bit fever hit world's gone to shit might as well quit and classic line as daryl says god i guess he was he was too stupid not to shoot himself in the head <laughs> But yeah, so they go on the run. Don't really find much. They get back to the highway and everything. Back at the farm, Glenn and T Dog arrive, and uh, Patricia helps out T Dog and gets him kind of stitched up, and you know gets his thing bandaged, his arm bandaged, and everything. And I mean, Glenn and them check on Carl and and with Rick and everything. And uh, Carl, Carl actually does wake up for a brief moment, but then he passes back out and kind of goes into a seizure and everything so this really freaks out rick and Lori. and uh shane arrives back at the farm with the supplies and of course he tells a story that otis is a hero he he basically saved him and he he shot you know he, he laid down fire so shane could get out of there which is total bs of course but of course that's that's the story he had to tell and after herschel gets the supplies uh, a little bit later he comes back and says that carl is stabilized and he's gonna be okay and uh and it ends with him you know getting inside and him going to go in to clean up in the bathroom and of course that's how the episode started and he notices that the the patch of his hair was missing so that's when he went ahead and shaved it off so yeah pretty intense crazy episode uh <laughs> Otis biting the dust thanks to Shane but yeah all in all not too shabby of an episode but anyways appreciate y'all checking this out I'll be back soon with episode 4 welcome to Windburn <laughs>